come and speak and then we're going to have an open mic. Um, so if anyone has had experience in, in the West Bank of Gaza, um, there are many of us here who, who would like to gain more insight into what is happening there. Oh, we have, sorry, we have Aziza Abu Dabad. Thank you. Gentlemen, all I'd like to say is that what's happening in Gaza now is murder and genocide. America spends millions and billions on settlements and weapons and yet spends no free time on peace. Why don't we have peace in the Middle East? Because peace will cost land. It will cost Palestine. Palestine must go back to the Palestinian people. Israel is wiping out families wiping out whole families, not just children, not just mothers, not just fathers, but whole families. We must stand up today and we must stand for the Palestinian people. America fights for democracy and free rights, but where are, where are Palestinians' free rights? Where is Palestinians' free rights and free speech and their land? Israel is bombing, bombing innocent children under the false pretension of they are saying that they are protecting their own. This isn't protection. This isn't their security. This is a whole lot of bullshit. Israel is killing the Palestinian people so they have free ownership of the land. Gaza is not a state. Gaza is not a country. Gaza is a, is a big military compound where they are holding the whole lot of Palestinian people, people that have no weapons, people that have no aid. Aid is not coming in, medical support is not coming in, everything is being blockaded. It is like a huge jail. Can you imagine Brisbane being a huge jail? Can you imagine Israel bombing Brisbane and people not being able to run away, not being able to get out, not being able to jump over the fences and the walls that they build? All that we ask is that everyone speak loudly and ask for a free, free Palestine. Thank you, everybody. I just got word that uh, there were 2,500 people who came out in uh, Sydney today. 